Hi, everybody, and welcome to Zelda One Randomizer Lua Co op Edition. I'm Jess Andy 8. And I am Truant Gamer. We are here to run a fun co op with each other where we get to share items and run out of keys together and just overall save a princess because who doesn't want to save a princess? Yeah, and the fun thing about this co-op is that it lets us share items between each other, so it's not just telling each other where to find something. If one of us finds an item, the other person will get it with limitations on a few things. But for the most part, everything gets shared. Yep, which is fantastic. So if someone finds a red ring that offers us quad protection, both of us get it. It's not one person getting it and saying, neener, neener, I got a ring and you didn't, which is quite nice for co-op. So I guess uh, I'm ready to start this whenever you are, Turrent. Yeah, we probably should just touch on the flags, though, for them really quick. Yeah, it's um, true. So for this, we are going with the Zelda 1 randomizer made by Fred Coughlin. And going with the... Started with the consternation base flag set, but we added on some fun things like rupee speed. So as we collect rupees, we're going to go faster. And uh, mixed overworld. So we'll see that there are more spots to check requiring more items in some cases. Yep, we definitely have some other thoughts as to possible upgrades to the flag set for some donation incentives that we can always talk about later. Uh, some fun things like mirrored overworld, but uh, for now, we're just going to do some playing and see what comes out of the seed. Yep, so I'm ready when you are, Jess. All right, can we count this down? Go for it. All right, here we go in three, two, one. Go! Ah, we're on my side of the world. Which means I got a long walk to the left. Oh gosh. The small secret is two rupees. We have that is Rias, quite nice. Rias and Lionels on the overworld for bombs to start with. Okay. Oh, there goes my two rupees. Koreas in the overworld are just not always good. <laughs> they are my least favorite enemy to find. Because they can just snipe you like none other. Oh, we also have Pole's voice in the overworld. Our lovely screen-scrolling friends. Oh, I'm gonna grab a candle out of take any. Sounds good. Our first bout of alpha. Oh! I do have a sword. That was nice and fast. And I got your sword. And we also have a heart on the coast. And I got first bombs. So thank you for that sword. It was great timing. I'm gonna check the other armor spots. Ooh, big secret. One thirty. Whoa! You got all the money. I only got two dollars. Two dollars. All right, I did find level six right by start. The burn bush to the left. I already forgot rupee speed was on, so I'm already going. <laughs> you are zooming. I'm gonna peek my head into level six for a sec and see if there's anything okay. cool in here. And I went so fast, I killed myself. <laughs> All at level six at. Uh, directly next to start where you at right now. All right, so can't go that way. We are key blocked out of six. I can always uh, swipe the key door, but we'll do that later. Oh, Lionels. All right, uh, there is no Armos item on this. Nope, I lied. There's still one more Armos. Also remembering that rupee speed stops you from screen scrolling. Yes, which is uh, easy to do, but when you have one rupee to your name, you can screen scroll all you want. All right, there's a lot of any roads down by Vanilla Start. All right. 
It's funny seeing you on your side, having difficulties getting into the holes. Oh, hey, guess what we have? We have a lovely bow as our Armos item. Very nice. That is very nice. So if you happen to see an arrow shop, would not be a bad thing. Oh, no! Yeah, that's going to happen a lot. Yep. Especially with this type of overworld. Yep, just about to say that. Haha, -ha, I found level one up in the northeast section. Uh, oh, well, right into a left landmola. A14 is where level one is. Thank you. Welcome. We're going to see. Oh, gosh. All right. One way only. I'd like to get through this blue landmola. Try it one more time, because it is not nice. Block clip. That's why I'm glad I haven't found any money yet. All right, container heart in the ground in one. Segmented in one. Bad fight. <laughs> it just depends. We are three up the V. I think I'm gonna try to bomb here. Aha! Secret bomb hole. I got level five. Nice. F7. F7. Another push block. It's an item. It's another heart. So far, a double heart one. One of the fun things about the co-op is you can always tell that you're connected to your partner because of what you see on truant screen. It tells you exactly what your partner has picked up. Oh, I finally got myself a key. I got one as well. Yep, so that's one of the things that we can share in a way our key count. But it's fun because your partner could unintentionally, accidentally use up all your keys and leave you stranded in the dungeon. Which we don't want that to happen. I mean... You got him. Well, it's a triple heart level one. I'm gonna use the other key if that's okay with you. Yep, go for it. Gotta find the Triforce in here somewhere. At least we're good on the white sort of. Oh, oh there we we might be meat blocked. There is a nice meat block here in level one. Uh, I'm close to meat. I can go buy it if you want to hang out there. Uh, meat's not shared though. Oh, see, I didn't know that. Yes, but I am buying meat chops so I can get some money. Yeah, we found that out during our last uh, partner co-op battle royale. And yep, meat is a single, single user only. Oh, I just got Gurian in the back. You are zooming. Uh, mixed hints. I'm going to yes. buy some hints. Ooh, fun. Apparently, Truant is the king of the world. Yes, but we already knew that. Uh, okay. I don't want to buy any more hints. I'm losing all my money. <laughs> you just want to zoom fast. Ah, uh, waste, wasteful hints. Oh, goodness. 
sometimes you get some really great hits, sometimes you get absolute squat. I just want some bombs. Oh man, too bad I have so many bombs. Oh, that's right, I have... <laughs> I actually gained some money and I realize I can't block clip. <laughs> but can I screen scroll on 14 rupees? Let's see. Probably not. Oh, no. We'll just run around and try to avoid the Lionels. Oh, uh, we have a buff white sword item. So uh, with the book, we can get all the maps because these are not the traditional vanilla map. Uh, yes. They are randomized. <laughs> and directly to the left of the book that I just picked up is an old man that told me the old woman has a book in the forest. So thank you for that. They're co oping too. They are! Like, hey, did you meet my friend? Go chat with my friend. They have something cool for you. Ugh, I've lost my 14 rupees and I feel so slow already. Yeah, there's definitely a gradient there where it just seems like it picks up once you hit, like, the 40 mark. Yeah. Because even at, you know, 60 some odd rupees, you are just blazing. Small oh. secret. secret 31 <laughs> 31 whole rupees I think my favorite thing other than being able to outspeed uh wizard of beams is that you get like halfway into a cave when you enter it oh yeah I'm always afraid when I'm on a high amount of rupees that I'm going to run in and just immediately grab the middle item and not have a say in it. Like you almost did. Oh, 91 arrows. Mark that. Oh, I just got green again. That's all right. And of course, one thing we have learned during uh, co-op is you never try to do a retry. Even if you want to save on money, get something back, uh, retrying could screw up your partner's stuff. And we don't want that. We want friendly co-ops. Yeah, because doesn't it remove the stuff? Yeah. No, you're right. You're right. One of the ones we ran recently, somebody accidentally retried and their partner lost their wood sword and it was out of the cave. They couldn't get it back. So far on my side, I just have one in six. Yeah, I've only found five. Um, I'm gonna head up to... The, uh, well, no, I'm gonna die. That's what I'm gonna do first. <laughs> I'm gonna head up towards Death Mountain since I found Bob. Okay. Some more cash. I can buy some meat now. Aha! Perfect timing, because there's a meat shop right above me. I think I'm going to hop back into one quick while I'm up here. Try to get that complete, get our first Triforce. Lovely. At least we hope the meat block is actually something- ooh! That's a nice level. That's a duck. It's a duck. <laughs> He's happy to be here. Oh, I forgot about the land, Lola.
That is a very fun room you're in. Oh, sword, I will I will take that sword, thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, almost oh ran the land Mila. Alright, so I am back in one. Back one and a half a heart, which is always great. I probably should have went back and bought those arrows. see. Also, now that with the book, I realize I can bomb to the right out of the meat block room. <laughs> this is always great. So it's possible that I bought that meat for nothing. Oh yeah, I bought the meat for nothing. Oh well. So we have our first Triforce. Well, you may still need... No, you won't need the meat anymore. It'll be living in my, oh gosh, in my inventory just to say hey, I'm hungry. I should have just fed the meat guy to get it out of my, my stuff. <laughs> Alright, I'm going up to vanilla five, sadly not a screen scrolling method. Also, I missed going up the staircase. Alright, so you found a hollow white sword in the staircase so far. Oh man, you turned the clip. Oh, that's the rupee speed clip. Way to go. Got it. I was wondering if I was in that first zone of where it works again. Well, hey, you, uh, you have level 8, I got level 7 in the waterfall. We get both to tackle some large dungeons, hopefully for something good. You know, Truant, I wouldn't say no to uh, a nice ladder, maybe a nice ring. Maybe even a tutor? <laughs> I was gonna say, if you find yourself a key door, I wanna see if I can speed run this uh, block push to do a cannon. Oh, yeah. I've not seen a key door yet. Oh, I'm gonna up A and go find. I know where there's a key door I need to spend it on. I am an idiot. <laughs> it was a waste of a key. Oh well. <laughs> Wasn't even thinking. How dare! You lost our one and only key! But I can still block with Alright, that's a transport. We're gonna skip that for now. That just looks so funny when you can add a key like that. <laughs> runs through before the door even opens. Find a mugger, but I'm gonna skip the mugger for now. Except one of my hearts, and I did not want to give up my hearts. Oh goodness. Hi, Gliak. Oh, how about this, Truant? Ba bam On the floor in seven. Just a couple seconds too late. <laughs> it's always nice to find something like that. Free and easy. Oh, shoot. Oh, 
Oh, shoot. Yeah, I wouldn't mind a ladder myself. I'm finding a lot of Chevy rooms in here. Yep. Oh, and speaking of Chevy room, I just ran into a Chevy room. that weird 2Q6 room. What? Oh, I like that. Wand with fire is always great. Until you burn yourself to a crisp. The chubby room. Look what I got. What do you Oh! You have my tuner! You know what that means, don't you? That is my favorite item in this game. Uh oh. We have a lovely Patra. Sometimes digging the large dungeons is a good thing. It's there until it's not. Alright, so I believe our mugger here in 7 is required. So if you don't mind, I'm gonna go ahead and pay the mugger a heart. Go right ahead. Alright. Let's take the staircase first. Let's take the staircase first. Tempting. I'm taking the Triforce and I'm gonna get out of here rather than search for the other item. We have so many small dungeons to find. Yeah, good point. Yeah, because right now. It's really, uh, maybe a ladder? We could technically still be ladderless, you never know. But also, uh, silver arrows. Definitely required. And then potentially a raft, potentially a power bracelet. But for now, I'm gonna go tooting around the forest. Uh, true it in that tune, because I have no clue. <laughs> One of the fun randomizer settings you can randomize your recorder tune, which I like to do. Oh, I know it, but I don't know it. <laughs> you know, see, once it tells you at the end of the game, once we rescue the princess, we'll be like, oh, that's right, I totally knew that. Alright. I'm gonna toot in the desert. I'm getting nowhere fast, literally. The light is not being kind with an easy Triforce or even a compass. Here's your compass. Yeah, I need arrows. You need arrows. Ah, I think I'm just short to buy arrows. Actually, let me double check. That might not be the room I think it is. 
but I know where arrows are. I can go buy them if I have to and save them for the trip or make a trip back later. All right, I'm going to hop into six now. Let's get this door opened. Yeah, I need arrows. I'll wait and see. I mean, if it's the last thing I grab before uh, going to nine, no big deal. Whoa, this is a, a fun map. Oh. Well, I opened that door for pretty much nothing. Can, can vertical shoot drop in six? I believe so. Alright, I will kill them with my wand. Aha! There's a key there. But I can't get it! Because it's a vertical river room above it. I'm going to use a key and go north. I get to go the long way around to Death Mountain. Did you know that Gliak returns along the river? I would I never would have known that. Ruby speed makes uh, Dark Nut combat combat a little bit easier. Yes. I see that as I'm getting bodied by a room full of blue Dark Nuts. I'm gonna go out on easier a limb. to run away from them. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that the recorder is a Final Fantasy song. Oh, okay. That's probably like a 50 percent chance being right. That's true. Kind of a meme within the community that if you don't know what it is, it's always Final Fantasy. Nothing wants to bomb, so. so that section is all ladder blocked. Ah, uh, level three in the grave. Small level three. Oh wow, it is small. Forces. Oh, another heart. And staircase in six. You're gonna find you're gonna find silvers and a ladder in there. That's that's my prediction. I'm willing that into the world. Let's go. I was hoping for a key in this room, and then you get all the keys. Yeah, I'll take that over. Silver's right now. And it is. Raft. A Rafty boy. Search like two more rooms up here because it's way up here. And 
no more. Hey, nice map. <laughs> All right, and here is the Triforce and Six. All right, so you got a raft out of three, right? We'll go check my rest spot while I'm over here. And, and rest spot is just nothing. How far? Where did you start um, searching on your side of the map? Like, uh, have you done a right around vanilla start, or? I've got everything center left basically done except for grave, and I forgot the recorder spot at uh, F9 for start. All right, I'll grab that recorder spot quick. Oh, and the raft spot. Um, I'll grab those both of those for you. But you have, like, candle row and all of that done? Yes, and now we are flying at max rupees. Oh my gosh, you get all the money. Have you done, um, Forgotten Spot, C8, C9? Yes. Okay. Because on my side, unless I dig back into seven, I am empty. All right, F9 was nothing. Did you get the uh, recorder spots in Deadwoods then? Vanilla 4 is level 9. I got level 2. Alright, so you have 3, you have 2. Did you see 4 already? No. Just 5. Okay. So we're just looking for 4 then. Yep. Do you want me to come join you up in um, Death Mountain? My other option is to dig for the staircase out of N7. Uh, you can come over to Death Mountain. I didn't do the um, I didn't do the rest of the grave. Banana on the floor. I guess what is the rest of the what's the, what is the rest of the grave? <laughs> uh, I guess C. Uh, actually, I lied. I didn't do D four bomb spot in the grave. Okay. So just a heart and a banana and two. Gotcha. Bomb share the wealth. Yeah, that's one of my favorite things with the Lua script is you spent your money and I I read the benefits. Because I also get the bomb upgrade. And I got lost in the maze. You know, I like the rupee speed, sometimes it's a little too fast. Blasphemy. Never too fast. Alright. Alright, so I'll grab D the D for a bomb spot and then uh have you done East Death Mountain? Oh no, I have not done that. Okay. Can we, can we do east? You'll do west? Sounds good. If you want to check, um, I didn't grab. There's money in B5. In B5, okay. And then everything east of there, I didn't do. Okay. I grabbed a potion out of my last take on east. I'd say if you want a potion, feel free. Yeah, good enough on hearts. Potion just for coverage. Thank you for not taking that, because now I get to start zooming! That was a large secret. Very nice. Yeah, and now I'm at max rupees. Alright, 
right, now the big question's gonna be, are we gonna be power bracelet blocked? Out of level four. Check that uh, recorder spot near start, F9. Yeah, there was nothing. Okay, so then Mags is at the push block there. Okay. And East Death Mountain has nothing. And I did I did that spot where you're at right now. So I think we might be power bracelet blocked. Oh, well, I'm going to go back into five. I think I'll go back into seven then. Oh, I need to go around. Oh, that stinks. Usually I would cross the river right there, and I can't because rupee speed. Because <laughs> seven, I'm just looking for a staircase item. Did you? You said you got a floor item out of six, or no? No, you no, I got a floor out of six, not the floor. I figured I'd rather search for a staircase in seven than a floor in six. <laughs> yeah, I'm with you there. Alrighty, I'm now zooming. robes. Those are always fun. I'm glad you have them and not me. No offense. <laughs> yeah, not very squishy either. Are you staircase? We also don't have our ladder yet, which could be a bad thing. I'm gonna find it in here. You think so? What if I find it first in seven? Well, then it won't be in here. <laughs> you have uh, neither item, right? right? Out of five? I think I'm going to have to pay the mugger now. So, say goodbye to a heart. Womp, womp, womp. Say hello to ladder. Nope, heart. Nope. Say goodbye to a heart, say hello to a heart. <laughs> probably be a good time to say that this is slightly unusual for I would say slightly unusual but probably on pace for a co-op usually around 40 minutes is a good time and level 7 has a blue blue ride I'm going to go back to 6 and hunt for a floor item there yeah sometimes you get the trolley seeds and this one of course at first seemed really nice Hey, easy. But you just never know what you can get rolled. Oh. 
called it. You got a letter! Alright, so I think what I'm gonna do before I search the rest of six is I'm gonna go check those two ladder spots in the river. Yeah, good call. I'm gonna go buy those arrows and then clear eight just so we can be done with it. Yeah. So yeah, if we don't find we will report one of these ladder spots, then I will have to dig back into six for PB, I think. Yeah, that's our last place. The first spot did not bomb. Second spot bomb, but it's nothing. So I think we're in six. on those bombs. Oh well. Alright, now we have a ladder and I can go not that way. Turn to be fast. All right, nothing down this way. I'm going to take my staircase. Of course, the other thing that controls would be we still don't have our silver arrows. Yeah, those are a nine. You think so? Or do you know so? Did you get a hint? Uh, I'm just going with it. My lovely croissant. I did not check forgotten spot. No. Whoops. I I thought you did. If that's four, that doesn't be a trollerific for us. That's okay. Well, and sometimes that's how these seeds get you when you don't can't. Oh, I can ladder. Hold on. Oh yeah, that's true. You know, that's like the worst one to get to when you can't screen scroll and you don't have a ladder. Yeah, that is for sure. Okay, good. Now I don't feel bad. <laughs> hey, here it is. Way up in the top of six. All right, I'm going to check the Death Mountain spots here since I'm here. All right, and I will check the spots on this side. So the find four. And I, I think we should do uh, get the Triforce as fast as possible. One person go to nine. One person continue clearing four. Yep, exactly what I was going to say. It's one of the fun parts of co-op is you can send people in different locations for different aims. Got it. It's at 2Q4. Alright, I'm gonna head back. 
Yeah, good. We'll just camp outside nine then, I guess. That sounds good. Hopefully it's not a very large force, so hopefully it'll be pretty quick. Unless I run out of bombs, then that would be bad. Yeah, don't do that. Red candle. Alright, four, four red candle and four. Alright, I'm gonna head right towards the compass first. Or towards Triforce, I mean. Of course it's behind the Gliak. Because why wouldn't it be behind the Gliak? So pop in now to get rid of him, and... There you go! You are free to enter level 9. Alright, now I'll get digging. Alright, and I'm going to come back in here really quick and just search for the staircase item. Because right now we just need some silvers. Over there. So we're what, 50 50 now? I believe. Goodness. We're in the last location in this room, aren't we? It's when you Oh! Well I guess it's in here, it's a good thing. Trying to peek around for I think Zelda might be down here by chance. Here's my staircase. Dun dun dun, silvers! Alright, I will come meet you over there. I'll toot to five. Alright, I have Ganon, so I'm gonna go fight him now. Um, so, what I can you see my tracker or no? No. Okay. So, uh, when you enter level 9 and you go up one room, it forces you right. I took the first staircase and that led me to Ganon. So, if you want to go past that, look for Zelda.
way. Yeah, you're, uh, go up there. I didn't go up from there. I went you go up here, okay. One thing that it does share, though, is the map, so you can always press the button to see the rooms I've been in. Or press yeah, the button. pretty screen. cool. Oh, this is the way. Come back my way. That's it, GG. Two below the E. I got 48.52 on the timer. Do you want to do, uh, both of us have to save the girl, or just one of us? I think one of us is fine. One of us okay. is still Ganon. True. Alright! That is Zelda 1 Randomizer Lua Co-op! That was a fun time! Yeah, like I said before, it sometimes you're shooting around 40 minutes is probably a good time. Uh, 48 isn't terrible. There are a lot of trolls in this one. I think a couple... Yeah, we basically full cleared this, this seed. <laughs> yes, we absolutely full cleared it, and we had two item block dungeons, so when that happens... Yep. Uh, yeah, it, it was a chain reaction seed, so... Yep, just the luck of the draw. Yeah, I would probably say 45 minutes is a good estimate for even if we added in any of the bonus incentive options uh, or the bid war type things for adding in uh, I did not see what the recorder was <laughs> oh have to look back on that but uh, yeah I'd say uh, 45 50 minutes is probably a good time estimate yeah yeah and some of those incentives like mirrored overworld so everything's going to look backwards like we went Alice in Wonderland through the looking glass um, that's always a fun one a little bit controversial in the randomizer community because a lot of people don't play it so then they don't like to play it but when you enjoy it it's a lot of fun <laughs> and it is a lot of fun yeah it's one of my two favorite flags and then uh Truett mentioned a couple of other things we could do some some bid wars for one of them would be to change our sprites i'm i'm always pink link i think you're always green link yeah four is green um, link specifically yep so we could change either colors or we could change to other sprite you know we could play as enemy sprites we could play as zelda um that could be some fun things as well as the other one you mentioned was bidding on potential starting items versus starting offense yeah i figured uh there's the three overworld items uh like recorder power bracelet or raft we could always do a bid war for one of those three things to expedite the seed a little bit if we wanted and Ruby Speed, of course, uh, does help the expedition along the way. It's a lot of fun. So um, that that is our submission. I think we'll get this sent in and wait to hear. And hopefully you enjoyed this. And hopefully we'll see you at the multi -thon. Sounds good. Thanks, Jess. Thanks, Drew. It was a great time. And we'll see you.